Frost. Q92, it's Hearts Magic Man, Mellow McEwen at 712. Looking at a little bit of snow to start today. We've got about 2 to 4 centimeters before it's all said and done. Temperature falling off to minus 16. And then back to cold tonight, low down to minus 22 with a wind feeling like minus 27. And then we'll see uh, mainly sunny skies tomorrow, although it is going to be a cold one. High minus 15 with the wind feeling more like minus 32. Right now at the Q Studios on LaSalle, minus 9 degrees. So in the studio this morning, I'm just taking a picture of a tarantula right now. Okay, there we go. Uh, <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, Jeff uh, and Megan are here from Little Ray's uh, Reptile Zoo. You're in town this weekend down at the Radisson, and you brought some great exotic animals into the studio this morning. Right now, you were holding on to whom? Uh, this is Chili. Uh, he's a rose-haired tarantula from down in Chile in South America. So You have a tarantula figured, in your hand. Yeah, well, I figured everybody's favorite animal, we should show him first. The, uh, oh, my God. So what do you think about that, Chris? It's a big, hairy spider. Yeah. Like, enormous. That's going to shoot webbing out at any time. Yeah. Actually, yeah. right now, if it pooped, it would hit you. <laughs> that's good to well, know. I, I, I guess that sets my mind at ease a little bit more than the giant human cocoon. So. <laughs> okay. Can I uh, can I hold? Yeah, on for of course. Yeah. Okay. So now I've got a tarantula in my hand this morning. So let's talk a little bit more about what some of the other stuff that we can see down at your interactive zoo at the Radisson this weekend. Uh, well, obviously we have the tarantulas. Yeah. Uh, we have a couple other raptors. We've got emperor scorpions. Um, all of which people can hold while they're there uh, seeing all the animals. Um, as for other really, really cool stuff, we are going to have, uh, we do have Lady Chomps a lot. People have seen her before. Oh, yeah, she's been on the show before. Yeah, she's yeah. been in the studio before. She'll be back. Uh, at least I believe she should be back. Um, we'll have We were hoping snakes. Simba, the African lion, I, I know here, people, but I, I know, she's been delayed. No, she's been delayed. She, uh, she shouldn't be arriving. I actually have no idea when she gets here today. Okay, all right. She arrived this afternoon. Royals we actually Diva. haven't even seen her ourselves. Diva. Okay. Uh, we've not Diva. met her yet either, but, uh, yeah, the Simba should be arriving sometime this afternoon. Um, hopefully her cage will be up by then. We haven't even started setting up yet. So okay, yeah, yeah, I know you got a lot of setup to so do, and it's a really uh, nice interaction. So she'll show up, and uh, then uh, we'll have the lion here for everybody. Okay, uh, so I I'll give you back. I can't believe you're taking your eyes off that spider at all. It's like, Good it's Lord. like you know, it's fine, but I just... Uh, fine. Okay. <laughs> All right. So now, uh, Megan is over here. Chrissy. She's going to pass us a uh, very cool. If you're watching live on Eastlink, do, don't miss this. Um, this is a big snake. <laughs> That's, that's what you need to know. The technical the term. Is out, this out is the why box. they have other people down at uh, Little yeah. Race to okay. explain Okay. Now, I did have this big snake around my neck, and she likes to cuddle, so I got it off. Ooh. Okay. So who's this, Jeff? Uh, this is Anita. And uh, Anita's a yellow anaconda, so found down in South America as well, just like the tarantula. Um, smaller version of an anaconda. Everybody always thinks of a green anaconda, the really, really big one you see on TV in the movies that they made. Uh, this would be that guy's little uh, little cousin. Well, little, how big little. is the edge? Uh, well, right now she's probably around nine feet. Um, full grown, around maybe 12 is the average, so okay. not and, and giant. And does she eat? I mean, what does she eat? Jennifer uh, Lopez. She would eat peanut. You guys saw peanut earlier, little oh, caimans, they, little crocodiles yeah, and stuff like that. Yeah. Uh, capybaras, which are like giant guinea pigs. Yeah. Uh, things like that. Those would be their main source of food, but they'll eat uh, all kinds of small, like we feed our chickens. Uh, you know what? Oh, chickens. That's good. <laughs> well... Well, I bet she would have enjoyed the double down, yeah. I think. <laughs> but she is beautiful. And if you've never, ever uh, had the opportunity to see or touch any of these uh, snakes, uh, and like this is just it feels so soft it's and amazing, smooth yeah. and cool. And we were holding on to a baby python earlier. Yeah. Man, it's just, you know, people really come down to little rays and, and touch and see the animals like that? Uh, definitely, yeah. Even whether we're, you're coming right to the zoo in Ottawa or here or at one of our other exhibits, we try to focus on the interaction part as well as the educational part. So when we have the animals, we definitely have, like most of the animals that we're going to be bringing up here to Sudbury um, are able to come out of their cages. We're able to uh, let you guys interact with them. We do have the ones that won't come out of their cages, of course. Right. We have uh, some birds of prey that are coming, well, great horned owl. Um, we will take uh, the other two birds that we'll have out. We fly one of them around and stuff like that. Uh, Sim wow. Simba. Simba will come out for shows. Yeah. Um, uh, he is unfortunately offhand. Like people won't be able to touch him, as far as I know, um, and things oh. like that. We might have a. We have. A, I think we. I heard we're gonna have a lemur. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Chris. Next time. Yeah. Next there, time yeah, you come, we want a lemur. That, in the uh, yeah. I'm pretty sure people might get a chance to pet the lemur. I know they did last time. Yeah. That they had the, we had the lemur out. 
Uh, we will have uh, venomous snakes, which obviously won't be, uh, <laughs> be coming out of their cages, but we will have some rattlesnakes. We'll have Tut, our King Cobra, which is one of only two on display in Canada. Oh my god. Cool. You know what? There's so much to see this weekend down at the Radisson. Uh, Little Ray's Reptile Zoo in town. Uh, tickets are 10 bucks at the door. We've got some tickets to give away coming up on Battle of the Sexes here on the queue. Uh, Jungle Jeff, Polar Bear Megan, and all your various Sissy Chrissy. forms of friends. <laughs> Thanks so much for coming Not in this morning. I want to I want to I want to do the snake around the neck again thing okay okay all Sounds right good. thanks guys